Okay, hey everyone, welcome to the scrolling, cubing, and star forcing of the Meistering. So, this is one of the new equips that I'll be working on uh, two parts. So, it will be focused on the xenon for the scrolling and then for the cubing and the star forcing I'm going to be doing that on the Corsair so that is the alternate account that I have going where it's a level 230 Corsair that I did gear on this channel once upon a time with Legion and everything else that's come along it's kind of become redundant to have two different accounts uh, so I'm focusing all my resources onto one account and using the Corsair and all of its other characters to do all of my supporting, so that's crafting cubes, crafting things like the Meister Ring or backups if I require them, as well as any EXP potions that I might need as well. So that's just because I don't want to interrupt any of the time that I can spend training, so pretty much I'll have the second computer sitting there uh, doing all of that stuff while I'm there training. Because it's since it's on cooldowns and stuff, you can pretty much time it out so that you know every like 5 minutes or 15 minutes, depending on what you're crafting, you know you can make something. Uh, so yeah, so it's unfortunate for that character to go that way, uh, but yeah, I'll, I'll yeah, get into what plans I tend to do with the Corsair gear in a later video. But yeah, uh, R.I.P. Corsair. Oh my god. So yeah, so I was pretty happy with how the uh, scrolls went on the ring. Uh, so pretty much what I used in terms of those Guardian scrolls, I didn't end up using any actual money so I used a little bit of maple points from the hair coupon refund uh, that happened last month I think or might have been started this month and then uh, yeah so pretty much the money from that and then the uh, two from the reward shop as well so the event shop so I had two sitting there and then the most expensive part of it was the protection scrolls which were 500 mil each from the auction house but yeah happy with that 40% chance pass rate to pass all three and uh, yeah, so now just on to cubing it. Uh, so yeah, so everything cubing wise that's tradable will come through the Corsair. Uh, everything else that's pretty much uh, already locked the the Xenon, so just say like the whip, how it doesn't have that good of a bonus potential. I'll get around to doing that eventually. I haven't really worked out how I'll get there since the bonus potential cubes are pretty hard to come across other than actually using, uh, you know, NX in the cash shop unless I can convert some meso to maple points uh, which I haven't really looked into doing yet but it could be an alternative that uh, could be quite uh, useful uh, so yeah so that's pretty much how things are gonna run uh, so yeah it's I find that it's the best way to uh, like work most efficiently with my time so having this character sitting there making cubes while I'm training you know I tend to do about two hours a day training so I can sit there on the Corsair crafting all the cubes that I need probably for the week like it's not up to doing Meister cubes just yet which is why I didn't continue once I got unique on the ring here uh, but it'll have Meister cubes eventually uh, so then you know I can start using those and then I'll pretty much make them over the course of a week and then I can make a video out of, out of it with a lot of cubes to use rather than just like I think that's just like a day's worth that I've just been sitting there crafting uh, so yeah so then I've got the Paladin set up for making the Meister Ring and then uh, another character for doing some EXP potions. So pretty much all the three items that I'm requiring at the moment uh, are pretty much coming through this account so it's a good uh, way to use the resources that I get from grinding anyway because you're only farming veins and uh, the mysterious herbs and all of that and it's dropping all those so yeah it pretty much yeah, gives you the opportunity to get all those things, use them to craft you do have to buy the odd thing from Auction House, but even if you're only buying like one material required for it, it's really not that bad of something to use. And uh, yeah, so then going forward, I think it'll work quite well and it'll make for some enjoyable content. And uh, yeah, hopefully I can go and find myself another Primal Essence because this shit's gonna get expensive. See you later. <laughs>